Hello everyone, Spencer here with NichePursuits.com and today I wanted to show you how I brainstorm for keywords and then expand that root keyword list into lots of additional keywords that I can begin to filter and narrow down. So first, uh, there's a few different ideas. I wrote a blog post about 15 different ways that I use to brainstorm for keywords. And so you can go and read that for more details, but one of the ways is just to look around you or take note of things you're doing and to jot down keyword ideas. So this morning I was listen, listening to a podcast, so I wrote down the keyword podcast, so that's one root keyword. Um, another thing that I discussed doing is using Google Instant, and one of my readers suggested a good idea that I liked a lot, and that was to type in things like, how to or problems with or how do I things like that so I, I typed in so I'm gonna type in how to uh, and then just a letter you know we'll throw in a letter B um, and you know you can see you got lots of potential keywords I, ideas here how to build a fence um, so I'll, I'll jot down build a fence as a keyword idea um, then let's throw in a T here um, maybe an I so how to tile there's another you know any of these could be root keywords you know tie dye tie a bow tie a tie tile I'll write down how to tile um, so um, then another way I discuss getting root keyword ideas is going over to amazon.com and uh, simply scrolling through some of the categories so if we come down here to home garden and tools we'll click on uh, patio lawn and garden and any of these could be keyword ideas lounge furniture dining furniture string trimmers gas grills swimming pools let's um let's try fire pits here so i'll, I'll write down fire pits and maybe let's grab one more so we'll have five root keyword ideas total um, if we come back here, toys, kids, and baby, go to baby uh, category. Um, we got lots of car seats. These are uh, convertible car seats, it says. So let's write down the word convertible car seat. So as you can see, it's pretty simple to come up with root keyword ideas. I don't know if any of these will turn into anything profitable or not, but this is how I start. So then you go over to either the Google AdWords keyword tool and you can type those in one at a time that's a free tool or you can use things like Market Samurai uh, which also you can only do one keyword at a time so it is very time consuming but I'm going to give you a brief demonstration of my new keyword tool called Longtail Pro and this isn't going to be a full demo I just want to show you how to expand some lists I use Longtail Pro um, it's not quite available for everyone else. There's, we're um, uh, testing some additional things, so the full functionality isn't ready for everyone, unfortunately, but uh, the keyword generation part I can show you here. So I'll type in my five keywords. We had podcast, uh, build a fence, how to tile, fire pits, and convertible car seat. And as you can see, I can do all five keywords at once. I'm going to select exact match. I'm already logged into Google, which means I can get up to 800 keywords ideas at once. And again, I'm not going to go into great detail, but I'll just show you quickly what it can do. You can automatically check for exact match domains. You can select your extension here. Um, I won't do that right now. But you can do that. Um, you can, and then you can also check the title competition. Then what we do want to do is we want to filter out any keywords that don't meet our criteria. So I always say a thousand minimum. Maybe let's put uh, two thousand, just because um, you know to to narrow down my list a little bit and have one dollar CPC. Um, remember, I I don't want keywords with a thousand I prefer to have two thousand three thousand or more so I'm gonna just start with two thousand that's why I did that and uh, also I kinda like to um, narrow down on number of keywords too 
So I'm going to say two or more. Usually a keyword that only has one word, is it's going to be pretty hard to rank for, typically. So I'm going to just start with that. I'm going to hit Generate Keywords, and that'll be it. Um, within a few minutes, I can come back here, and it's going to have generated all of those keywords, and then filtered out. Um, based on the criteria I put there and then I'll only be left with uh, the keywords that I want to see. So right now you can see that um, it's fetch fetching keyword ideas and it's looking for podcast related terms. So it's going out to the Google AdWords keyword tool and it's pulling in um, up to 800 or so keyword ideas um, from that keyword tool and of course that takes just a minute to do that and then it'll move immediately on to the next keyword so now it's mo now it's going to build a fence uh, that keyword and once it's gone through all five keywords and generated um, all of those it'll then filter out based on the criteria that we specified so I'm going to go ahead and pause the video but you can see it goes fairly quickly. It's only taking, um, you know, probably less than a minute per keyword to generate um, additional keyword ideas. So I'm going to pause that now, and we'll check back as soon as it's done. Okay, Longtail Pro is now on our last keyword, and you can see we've already generated over 3,000, 3,329 keywords. It's about to add some more, but then it'll very quickly uh, filter those out. So we're going to be left with only I don't know, a few hundred or so, um, 52. So there was only 52 keywords, um, which is great. That is a huge time saver. Rather than looking through 4,000 keywords, now we're only left with 52 keywords that meet our criteria, um, that have at least a dollar cost per click and have over 2,000 exact match local searches. And I can filter these by searches, so if I want to see high volume, so chain link fence, how to build a deck, um, the tile shop, glass tile backsplash, all of these are potentially great keywords. Or if I just want to go for the high paying keywords, you know, I've got wrought iron gates, how to build a fence. You can see that I went from around 4,000 keywords down to 52 just based on my criteria. And again, there's a lot more you can do with the tool. Um, you can check for exact match domains. I could have done that automatically. Or if I check it now, it'll go through and show me what are avail what's available. But I don't want to make this video too much longer. Um, I just wanted to show you how to um, you know, expand your keyword list, how to brainstorm, and be left with some great keywords. Now comes the critical part of going and checking the top 10 competition in Google to see if these are actually low competition keywords, keywords that you believe you could rank for. And that'll have to be a video for another time. Um, that's all that I wanted to show you at this point. Again, you don't have to use Longtail Pro. There's lots of other keyword research tools out there. And this isn't available right now, but uh, I did want to show you what I use and what's coming um, very soon. Uh, we'll be doing some more testing and in, within a couple, uh, two, three weeks, uh, we'll get some beta testers going uh, that the public can uh, begin testing. So thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed the video.